Why is Iran's photonuclear facility so hard to destroy? And why does Israel need US help to even have a chance? Fordo is Iran's ultra-secure uranium enrichment plant, hidden deep inside a mountain near the city of Qom. It's not just any facility, it's built to survive almost any kind of attack. We're talking about more than 80 meters or over 250 feet of solid rock and reinforced concrete above it. Inside, Iran uses advanced centrifuges to enrich uranium to levels close to what's needed for a nuclear weapon, though Iran says it's not trying to make nukes. So, why can't Israel just bomb it? Here's the problem. Israel's most powerful bunker buster bombs simply aren't strong enough to reach for those deepest chambers, and they don't have the heavy bombers needed to carry the world's largest bunker busting bomb. The US, however, has the GBU-57, nicknamed the Massive Ordnance Penetrator. It's a 13.6 thousand kilogram bomb designed to smash through up to 60 meters of earth and concrete. It works by using its massive weight and hardened casing to drill deep underground before detonating, collapsing bunkers buried far below the surface. Even with this weapon, destroying Fordo isn't guaranteed. It might take multiple hits, and there are still unknowns about the facility's design. But without US help, Israel simply doesn't have the tools to do the job. And here's a big picture. Any strike on Fordo risks sparking a much wider conflict in the region. That's why, despite the technical capability, the US has so far held back from taking direct military action.